Sudfeld going towards the end zone, it's wide open. Touchdown, Jay Sean Harris. In 2014, to get named Offensive Newcomer of the Year that year, it was pretty awesome. Harris weaves in the open field. My mindset going into my sophomore year was kill or be killed. Everything was clicking on all cylinders until, you know, our very first player practice and I ran an out route. Went up for it and just came down and you know hyperextended my knee and later found out it was my ACL. You think surgery, you're gonna need help, you're gonna need someone home to take care of you. But I couldn't do it. Leah was my eyes. They would say he needs the ice as much as he can and then I would ask him, do you want me to change the ice? And he just said, no, I'm good for a little while. And so then I call his mom <laughs> and say he wouldn't and then he, was, he would be like, turn on the ice. Yeah. <laughs> the pain was like shell shocking. You get this throbbing, throbbing, throbbing. It's just like, please cut my leg off so this can stop. In 2016, you know, I wanted to come back and be the player that I was. My very first live scrimmage in fall camp, I caught a bubble going down the sideline. I tore my left ACL and there the process started again. He FaceTimed me and I immediately saw the background of the training room. I couldn't believe we were like right back where we just came from. I've never seen him cry, but he, he was crying that time. There was a point where I was like, you know, this is, you know, why me for a little bit? And, you know, once I noticed that wasn't getting me anywhere, you know, it was just all about how I wanted to respond and I didn't want to be the victim. First time being on the field after two years, in the game time atmosphere, just running out of the tunnel, you know, touching the rock and then you know, they, they shooting the fireworks, everything was just awesome. They're like, I'm back. And I was finally, you know, starting to get some reps at receiver. Everything is coming together. Jay Sean Harris got some room to run. Add another chapter to his comeback story. And then against Maryland, felt my knee popping. I went back out to line up an outside receiver, and as I was, you know, getting in my stance, my knee shifted. And Jay Sean Harris limping a little bit, called for the timeout. I knew right then that something was wrong. And he will limp off the field. My mindset after the third ACL was a lot different. I was leaning more towards not playing. I could have, you know, decided not to and, you know, went on to live life outside of football or try to enjoy this football thing one more time. And it's like, let's do it. Jay Sean Harris is that deep. Gets to the outside, a couple of touchdown returns. Harris may go all the way. When he scored, oh my gosh, that was the best feeling ever because he worked so hard to get back to that end zone. And he did it. My style, I try to mimic guys like Tavon Austin or Tariq Hill or one of our former players, Shane Went. Our legs and our feet are our money because we're not guys that's going up and you know snagging balls over corners that are six foot. You know, we have to get in those holes and you know find the holes in the defense. We have to be able to move quick with our feet. The power that he's able to generate, it's huge to be able to have that strength, or else he's never gonna be able to make the cuts, uh, you know, make the explosions, get in those holes and explode out of it. Having the multiple surgeries, a lot of times guys come back different players. Jay Sean, that's what's so remarkable about it is he's come back the same guy. He's able to put his foot in the ground and doesn't have a hesitation about it. That's the reward, that's why we do the job. When he scored the touchdown the other day, I texted my old assistant, Colin Francis, who had worked with him a ton. Oh my God, I hope you're watching this. And he just texts back, I'm in tears. He's an example for guys that we have in our program that suffered a serious injury. Look what he's gone through. You can do the same thing. Life's not fair sometimes. And obviously it doesn't seem very fair for a kid to get three serious injuries in one career, but they haven't faced him. He's stronger because of it, he's a better man because of it, and we're a better team because we have Jason Harris.